Okay, let's get a reading here. See what we got. Let's get it to steady. Come on, read. Dang it, I think the temperature's so cold it's not locking. I got it to minus five before. Come on, stupid thing. Minus five, there you go, minus five, minus two, minus seven, minus six. Let's call it minus six. It said minus four at the airport reporting station, which is south of me, so we're going to call this a minus six, and I actually got it to fire up. I don't even know how the camera angle is going to be on this. I'll try to keep it up as much as possible. And this will probably be not a lot longer than a three minute ride. See, I got my battery charger there. I had to use it to get it to fire off this morning, but it did. Not easily. It was complaining. But let's see if we can get a short ride in here before football starts. I want to catch that first game, Baltimore Ravens versus the Patriots. And I got to creep against this stuff. Don't want to fall down on the snow because this stuff is packed. It's almost as hard as ice. I'm sliding already so I'm just gonna if I have to duck pedal it all the way out to the end of the block I'll do that because then I get clear okay as you can see by the snow piles we've had quite a lot of snow lately and I wanted to at least one time before the first two weeks of January get a sub-zero ride in. Hopefully the camera hasn't shut down. I think it's still running. And the helmet may fog up probably pretty badly. But I'll get my three minutes in. Wow, this thing doesn't want to respond. Let's see where the choke is here. Okay, that's it. This needs a little more choke. Yeah, this is going to be pretty much a fogged up ride. You're not going to probably see a lot. Let me see if I can, without killing myself, if I can open this visor. Just do a quick three minute ride around my neighborhood. I'm going to have to close it in a few minutes though or I'm going to get frostbite on my face. And silly me, I ended up uh, forgetting my coat. I'm not even wearing my coat. I'm just wearing my jumpsuit. I've still got like about two or three layers on, so not a real big deal. Uh, yeah, minus six is rather brisk. Probably just uh, go down to the shopping center at the end here and then turn around and ride back. And hopefully that'll be full three minutes. If not, it'll uh, just have to be a fail at sub-zero, I guess. <laughs> I'm going to go back and warm up, get some hot coffee, and watch me some football games. Oh well, this light ain't going to trigger with nobody else coming, so I'm going to have to actually go on the highway. We're going to get some burr cold <laughs> speeds here. We'll get up to about 45 maybe. <sighs> Go up and do a turnaround up here. And the bike's cranking about this. It just doesn't want to run on anything except for about three quarters choke. And then we'll do a turnaround here. on back. I'll open the 
visor. Hopefully the wind won't be too bad. Uh, I left my turn signal on. Left my turn signal on during the whole way. I think the fog on the visor is actually frozen up and turned to ice. It's not even clearing now when I open it up. At least cleared before. But if the camera stayed running, at least got a minus six right in. when I woke up and I saw that minus four that it would be just a little bit colder here or at least if I uh, took my time and waited an hour to do the ride it would still probably be at least one below zero and with the sun out hopefully it'll uh wow this choke's real sensitive in the super cold weather this choke has to be just positioned the right way So anyway, I'm hoping somebody else, since mine isn't official obviously, mine is just for the fun of it, this will be my third official as far as just becoming a member, but nothing else, no prizes or anything, so I'm hoping somebody else will uh, be able to put a Sub-Zero right in. We used to have plenty of uh, Sub-Zero weather in the first two weeks of January, but I think this is just the second day we've actually had where I woke up in the morning and it was still below freezing. Okay. I'll just go real slow and leave it uh, open for the rest of the ride and maybe you can hear. But even with the mittens on, I've got my gauntlet mittens on and the very tips of my fingers are starting to hurt kind of bad. If I do this next year, I may end up breaking down and being wimpy and getting some hand warmers just to stick in. So uh, if I do decide to go on a longer ride, I don't end up stranding from my fingers freezing. Okay, now the fun part is getting back in the driveway without falling down. I'm pretty sure that has to be three minutes by now. Nice and straight, no leaning. Get her in the driveway, get her in the garage. Okay. I think we can call that one done.